Um, Saturdays in Dardanelle were exciting because you couldn't find a parking place downtown. It was shoulder to shoulder people. Everybody from the countryside came to town to buy their groceries, go to the Joy Theater, go to some of the pool halls perhaps. Uh, so it was really a hustling, bustling uh, atmosphere. It was a lot of fun. Uh, and people took real pride in, in their personal property and in the beauty of the town. We live in Dardanelle. We are Yale County people. My family has had a retail presence on this street since the 1800s, from Boyce Brothers Supply to the Dardanelle Mercantile to Save Us Some Market, which my father and mother started, to our business here, which my mother and I started 49 years ago. So we, we live in Dardanelle, and this is home to us, and our history called us back here. Dardanelle was a much different town then. There was a very large well-educated merchant class and this whole downtown area was very thriving. Lots of businesses, lots of excellent merchants who were well-educated, invested in the community. It was a totally different ball game from what it is today. It was fun. Mother and I were very close and we both decided that we didn't actually love what we were doing. We would stop teaching and put in our store and uh, we did it together and it was always fun. We should work together to, be, to build a more vibrant downtown community. There's lots of room for improvement. So uh, Darnell was, it was something that you could do and not be fearful of your kids out at night running around. We are blessed to have this river because it's a natural resource on this song river. I head out here at 7, get home after 6, uh, usually have to check the farm after that, uh, and then a couple of days a month I'm working with Chambers Bank, I work on the board of directors there, this is kind of my third job and I needed help. And my middle son, Jason, has moved back to the farm and I'm so proud that he came home and became the fifth generation on this farm. And if he was still running around here, we would see the sixth generation, two-year-old grandson. We have an airport out here. It's called the Centerville Airport. We really enjoy it. And we enjoy taking children flying a lot. They've never been up in an airplane. If you look around Dardanelle today, you'll see a beautiful old courthouse that is 102 years old. Uh, Dardanelle High School has great reputation does extremely well. Uh, there are several businesses in Dardanelle that, that are up and coming and, and hard working and highly successful. Uh, we just need to spread that kind of pride and achievement orientation to other groups and to other people.